Greetings, WordPressers. In today's show, you are gonna learn how to add a beautiful, responsive image gallery to your WordPress website. Jackson here, welcome to the channel where I share tips, tricks, and tutorials all about WordPress. And if that's your thing, then please do go ahead and consider subscribing if you're new here. And also definitely check out the description below, it has all the show notes and information about all the things we're gonna discuss in the show today. But anyway, galleries, or specifically gallery plugins for WordPress, there are hundreds on the WordPress plugin directory, literally dozens and dozens and dozens. Some are good, some are bad, some are complete pants. And there's some big hitters out there. I mean, the next gen gallery has been around for years and is considered the industry standard for free WordPress gallery plugins. But there's one that I've turned to more recently, which I actually like better than the next gen gallery. And that is called the Envira Responsive Gallery. It's brilliant. I think it's easier to use is way more responsive than some of the other plugins and you can be set up in just a few minutes. So here we go with a tutorial. In today's show, how to add a beautiful responsive image gallery to WordPress with the Envira plugin. Okay, so I've got a demo site that we can install this beautiful gallery plugin on. Let's go grab the plugin from the WordPress repo. Gonna to go to plugins, add new. And let's just grab the name of that plugin. It's the gallery by Envira. Let's paste that into the keyword search and we should get our gallery as the first option there. Let's in click install now. And we'll activate that. And once it's activated, you'll see a new menu item here in the admin menu called Envira Gallery. We click that and we'll get the list of galleries that we have created. Of course, we don't have any yet, so let's add a new one and we'll get the form that we need to fill in. First things first, let's add our title and then we can add some images. You can either select them from your computer, so an image, images from your computer, maybe a folder, or you can select them from the WordPress media library. So I'm just gonna click shift and select all of those and click the insert into gallery button. Now, technically speaking, you've now got your gallery, but I just wanna tweak the settings slightly. There's on the light version, there's not too many settings to play with, but they are pretty flexible even on the light version. So we'll go to the config tab and the first thing we're gonna change is the number of columns. We'll make it three columns and we'll change the image size to equal. So it's kind of like a nice square, clean looking image. And then we'll just click the crop images checkbox and that will make your images uniformed in the grid view. Now we're kind of done. So if we click publish, we'll see we've got our gallery shortcode here, but we don't need shortcode because Envira Gallery comes with a little extra feature, which if we go take a look at our pages now, we're gonna go open in new link our pages and let's get the gallery on the home page we'll see that we've got a little gallery add gallery link so what we'll do is we'll just clear off all the text in that text editor and we'll click the add gallery button and we get our newly created gallery as an option we'll insert that into the home page and we'll click update and let's go take a look at it on the front end refresh that front end and we've got a beautiful grid gallery with pop-up light box where we can scroll through the different images. And check this out as well. Responsive, it's beyond responsive. It's easily the most responsive gallery out of the box, certainly non-premium plugin that I've come across in the WordPress repo. If we use the Firefox mobile browser view tool, and that's just uh, option command, M, we'll get a different mobile views. And you can see that immediately, based on the size of the browser or the browser width, it will automatically resize the images and also reduce the number of columns. Super cool. If we make that a little bigger, we'll see how just responsive this is. Look at that. Epic. Look at that. So there's one other feature which is because it's so responsive, 
if we um, were dealing with a theme that is full width, full browser width, and I can change this theme that I'm working with, the Cento theme, to full width by going to the customizer. And there's an option here to change the layout from wide to full width. So this will just give you an idea of how cool that looks at full width. Save and publish. Refresh that front end. And we've got a pretty epic gallery with the Envira gallery plugin. Awesome stuff. Easily my favorite free repo gallery for WordPress. Pretty slick bit of kit, the old Envira gallery plugin, but what's your way of adding image galleries to WordPress? Please go ahead and share your thoughts in the comments below. And if you like what you've seen here on the Jackson channel, I do encourage you to hit that subscribe button. But until next time, I'll see you later.